Are you a huge fan of Senseiya just like me? Then don't go away, this video will definitely be for you. What's up everybody and welcome back in another epic tutorial of the Rama Builders. So today we are going to create the helmet of the character Aldebaran and this is from the sign Taurus. So this is going to be the second helmet that I'm going to do. If you are familiar with Sincere, there are 12 gold sins. So this is the second one. If you haven't seen my first video, then follow the link here in the upper corner. So you all know what's coming up next, right? It's going to be a lot of sanding, priming and painting. So let's get started.
so now that everything has been sanded and primed and received their specific gold color it's time that we uh, put on a clear varnish this is a um, fast drying acrylic varnish and this will give everything that glossy look and also make everything less vulnerable for scratches and once that everything has been dried I'm going to coat this upper part of the helmet with this matte black paint and why matte and not glossy because every other part is already glossy and I think the matte black would give a much more better effect with that being said let's go ahead and coat everything with this clear varnish So the helmet of the Taurus sign is finished and yeah just look at it it's it's a beast it's um, one of my favorite helmets that I did so far and it turned out just perfect I uh, applied the correct uh, color scheme in the different gold paints and this to my opinion is uh, accurate as you can see in the Sensei anime. The horns on this helmet can be detached. I've inserted some uh, very strong magnets and it just locks the horn in place. It, they won't fall off. These are very strong magnets and very easy if uh, yeah, you want to uh, transport this helmet for uh, conventions of course. I don't know if you remember my first video uh, on the first helmet from the sign Arius that I did from um, the Sensei franchise, I changed the base for the helmet. I wasn't pleased with uh, the first attempt and I wanted to find something robust, uh, ancient and so I made this old tile. You have uh, on every tile the sign uh, at the top, at the front, uh, you know, the little logo of the Sensei franchise and at the back um, you have my uh, name tag my signature uh, whatever you want to call it and that's it for today folks um, by now you should know that I will be leaving you with some uh, cinematic footage of the helmet thanks for watching I hope you learned something if you also uh, trying to create helmets um, share some links some photos if you have questions please put them down below I will be happy to answer them for you thank you for watching and I will see you all in my next video Diorama Builders signing out bye everybody